what's up it's your boy j will coming back with another one and like i said last video ea has been in the gym working getting right trying to make sure madden is the game we want it to be even though they giving us updates that of things that we should have already had they have been coming with it and we got another update for you guys today if you want to stay up to date for the latest madden 21 videos especially with the next gen coming out soon for madden 21 you already know hit that sub button and like the video let's get into it let's go so for the key highlights we got today they are bringing gameplay tuning and bug fixing four new superstar abilities three new x-factor players 12 new superstar players and avatar customization ui improvements those are the key highlights and let's get into these gameplay updates fixed an issue causing the ball velocity to not always reach the desired speed on pacific qb passing animations tuning to improve deep zone defender reactions to cross routes from a single receiver side for highly rated defenders definitely needed that because i know in man coverage even his own sometimes if a receiver a real fast receiver is running a deep crossing route he's probably going to win that every time especially in man coverage if he's fast enough he will burn that dude that is on him tune in to slow down cut reaction time for linebackers and man coverage facing away from the qv fix the run blocking target issue with the gun wing flex weak inside zone play fix a rare issue causing qbs to appear to use an under pressure pass while not actually being under pressure they need to fix that because qbs were definitely tripping out when there was no reason for them to be tripping out i'm talking about no pressure and he's still throwing a wobbly ad ball like he fucking wins out there but uh new superstar abilities and superstar x factor update based on nfl player performance up to this point in the 2020 nfl season Fix an issue causing defenders and man coverage versus a block and release running back to sometimes instantly switch their assignments to blitz when seeing the running back start to block, resulting in the running back being left uncovered once he would run his route thereafter. That's a good fix as well. Newly added superstar abilities. They have new superstar abilities. Let's see what they are talking about. Let's see if it's going to get us back right in the game. Film study. Defenders with this ability will have full vision of plays. The offense has run five times each quarter via coach cam. Whoa, this is very interesting here. So now if you run a play more than five times within a quarter, you will be able to see what that what that guy is calling when he comes out in that play. So if there's a play that's been working for them a lot over over the game and you got a player in your def defense has film study you'll be able, you'll basically be able to guess where he's going to be throwing the ball unless he has a lot of different counter options to that route for the developer notes on this film study it says based on the feedback received from the Madden 21 beta we reworked this ability to perform more balance across our multiple game modes one of those adjustments is based on players telling us it is too easy for the ability to activate making it too powerful and response the ability will now require a variable number of repeated offensive plays play calls before activating this number will scale up or down based on the current quarter as well as the game's quarter length settings with the required amount always being displayed via x-factor vision and pre-play additionally defender knowledge of these repeated plays will be wiped out when a quarter ends giving the offense a bit more leeway with how they run their play calling i could definitely see some issues with this film study when it first rolls out so we're definitely going to have to see which players have this film study uh, attribute and superstar ability and we're going to have to test it out see how effective it is backlash ball carriers with this ability will cause increased fatigue penalties against their tackler when tackled via non-conservative tackle you know the guy who needs this Derek Henry because he has been rumbling and gumbling and he's been playing well I'm telling you he's been trucking dudes left and right like it ain't nothing what else we got we got re recuperation Players with this ability will recover from the effects of fatigue at an increased rate between plays. 
okay that is that's that's a good trait to have i mean I'm, I'm surprised they actually gave that a whole superstar ability on itself but um i wouldn't be mad to have that especially for those real fast guys or running backs like uh christian mccaffrey alvin kamara you can definitely overuse them um and that would be a great ability for those players even though that might get a little annoying if they're not getting tired honorary lineman non-offensive lineman with this ability will frankly win impact blocks when blocking defensive backs in the open field i thought they already had um I thought they already had a superstar trait that would allow O lineman to dominantly win against DBs, but uh, we'll have to see about this as well. Frankly, win impact blocks when blocking defensive backs in open field. So I'm guessing the O lineman won't be acting as clumsy. You know, when O lineman get in the open field, they're usually not as aware of what's going on and they'll usually run right by a defender so hopefully with this superstar ability they'll be able to uh you know be aware of where the defender is and be able to block them a little better so for the new x factor players we have alvin kamara can i get a round of applause for my man alvin kamara because he really should have already had the x factor he has the satellite x factor in the jukebox which will make him a dominant player in this madden 21 we also have levante david buccaneers linebacker he has the run stuffer x factor in the deflator and last but not least we have the forest buckner for the colts with the unstoppable force x factor and inside stuff you know that boy buckner he's been eating he's been one of the reasons why the colts have been playing so well this year and i think it's a big reason why Derek grumbling henry ran so big on the colts was because deforest buckner was out for that game and deforest buckner was playing even though i'm a Alabama fan you already know roll tight i don't think he would have been running as much havoc on the uh colts defense as he did but uh, you already know when the playoffs come, we'll definitely be able to see a matchup with them, hopefully. But uh, let's get back into this video. And for the new superstar players, um, we have a long-awaited player as a superstar player. Uh, actually, a good amount, actually. So y'all are going to want to stay tuned for this. DK Metcalf Seahawks. He has finally got his superstar ability. He's probably one of the best receivers in the NFL this year. I'm talking about swole as hell, and he's moving. So it's good to finally have him as a superstar factor. Uh, he has deep out elite and red zone threat. Also, we have Terry McLaurin, which is also another good superstar player to add deep in elite. And he has outside apprentice. Terry McLaurin, long time coming. He's a young receiver that has been eating. Aaron Jones, I'm surprised Aaron Jones does not have a superstar factor as well. He has backfield mismatch and recuperation, which is one of the new uh, superstar abilities they just added. Also, Calvin Ridley, my man Calvin Ridley, roll tight. You already know how we coming. Mid out elite and outside apprentice. Also, we have Darren Waller, which I'm surprised he has not already had one as well. He has tight end apprentice and short out elite. We have Jamison Crowder for the Jets, mid elite. That's a surprising one. Uh, Jamison Crowder, <laughs> just because he's on the Jets, really. But, I mean, he's a great slot receiver. But just surprised they're showing any love to the Jets as bad as they're playing right now. But that's what's up. We also have Brian Burns, the young backer out of the Panthers out of North Carolina. You already know he has the speedster uh, ability for the superstar and the strip specialist. So, I mean, he's going to be a big factor coming off that edge with speedster, man. I can see a lot of glitchy plays happen with that speedster ability, but we'll see. Miles Jack, Jaguars, outmatch and deflator. We have Jesse Bates for the Bengals, deep end zone, KO, and he has Acrobat. We have Alec Marpet for the Buccaneers, O-line. I did not know he's been playing as well, especially past these, these fa past few weeks where Brady has been taking L's, and uh, his, I guess his O-line has been playing great because he has, he has uh, O-lineman getting superstar factor. So he has posted up in Secure Protector. We also have Jonathan Allen coming in with a superstar ability. Let me tell you, that Washington football team defensive line is scary, bro. I'm telling you, it is scary. They have 
first round picks and superstars all over that Washington uh, D line. So man, him being added to that is just going to make them even more scarier. And also Josh Allen, the QB from the Buffalo Bills, he gets a superstar factor. Um, he didn't have a great game this past week, but he has had a pretty good season. And he probably is a top 10 quarterback this year. So I guess you cannot be mad about him getting his superstar factor. He gets quick draw and escape artists, which are two abilities that I think are good for Josh Allen because that's what he kind of does in real life. One off edition, Derrick Henry Titans Backlash is a new ability they said uh derrick henry has been added a new attribute ability which is backlash which is uh something he definitely needs because as the game goes on those defenders definitely do not want to hit derrick henry as they did in the first quarter so yeah defenders definitely they they should lose some fatigue when tackling derrick derrick henry as the game goes on and that might make Derrick Henry an uh, unstoppable running back in Madden, depending on how they have that set up. So for the superstar downgrades, we have the following players have been downgraded from X Factor to superstars. We have Drew Brees, old ass. He has pro abilities r removed. We have Calais Campbell, old ass. Unstoppable force and edge threat abilities removed. Calais Campbell is still a great player, but he's uh, been battling a lot of in injuries. And, um, you know, they just, I guess, had to take that X factor away from him. But he's still a superstar. The following players are no longer superstars, losing all abilities. Hoo-hoo! Demarcus Lawrence, get out of here. Rob Gronk, get out of here. Zach Ertz, why y'all doing my guy Zach Ertz like that? He ain't even been playing this year. That is one thing Madden don't need to do when guys don't play. How are you going to take How are you gonna take away a uh, superstar ability because he's not playing, because he's injured? like come on but also they have ty hilton he hasn't been showing up this year i think he might be watched uh justin simmons for the broncos i haven't watched too much broncos football but they took away his superstar abilities matt ryan yeah he can he can get that took even though he had a good game against the raiders justin edelman yeah he's getting watched carson wentz oh my god carson wentz we can we can have a whole nother video talking about how sorry carson wentz has been all year and i think the eagles might need to give jalen hurts a chance also we have ryan kerrigan in the washington football team losing his superstar and also Cortland sudden um i don't know if Cortland sudden should have lost his either because i think he's been battling injuries i don't know why man it takes away abilities for players who are battling injuries just does not make much sense but i digress the yard updates stay a bit stab stability enhancements for the yard update which uh you know what that means that means they just went and tuned a few things probably didn't do much for superstar ko updates stability enhancements and for the user experience UX updates, users can now link directly from avatar customization screens directly to the vanity store by clicking on the store advertisement or hitting Y triangle while viewing individual items. And that will wrap up our update for today. The first update of December. Let's see how many we'll get in December. I think we got like two or three in November. And it seems like EA has been working. They've added some new abilities. And I'm going to have to go on Madden and check out this new update. See if it's, uh, you know, playing right. See if they fucked up anything in the process. But you already know. Tell me what you think about this update. And you already know it's your boy Jay Will coming with another one. Sub to the video. <laughs> Sub to me and like the video. You already know how we coming, man. It's your boy Jay Will. Let's get it.